It was a celebration galore at Paradise Estate in Life Camp Abuja as Mrs. Anaga Enelo Idogo celebrated our 86th birthday anniversary with our family, friends and well wishes. The joyous moment featured cultural displays and expression of gratitude by the attendees. Indeed, this was the beauty of motherhood. <laughs> Speaking with ITV News at the celebration, the celebrant alongside our two sons appreciated God for witnessing the 86th birthday of the mother. I appreciate everyone for coming to celebrate with me, especially my children who have shown me the greatest care a mother could get from our children. I pray that God should continue to prosper them and bestow his blessings upon them all. Advise them to give heed to all the good counsels that I've given to them. And it shall continue to be well with them. Well, I'm happy to have her as a mother. And I'm taking advantage of that to celebrate every other, all the women worldwide. My mother fought for education. She was very careful to make sure we go to school and supported my father. Even when my father had other wives, my mother was very firm for her kids. So for me, she's a warrior, she's a victorious woman, and I don't mind celebrating her always. Also speaking, the Commissioner for Finance and Economic Planning, Ben Westhead, Honorable Michael Oglaba, harps on the vital role that women play in the society. The women actually do a lot of the work in bringing up children. So um, usually they get close to the children. Children pick up a lot of things from their mothers. Um, Motherhood is, if you, if you train a woman, educate a woman, you, you change society. Mama has given her life entirely, in all measure, to make sure that her children grow up and grow up well. So um, this is what we are seeing here today. The children have come to say thank you and to give back to her. So I think it's um, something worth it, something to be emulated and copied by all young, the young boys coming up. High point of a celebration was the cutting of a birthday cake. Hey. All right, wait, wait, wait. Fred George, ITV News.